नमस्कार गुड आफ्टरनून टू यू ऑल प्रेजेंट हेयर रिस्पेक्टेड अलिशेंद्रो डी मासी ऑनरेबल कंसल जनरल ऑफ इटली रेस्पेक्टेड संजय भटिया जी रेस्पेक्टेड राजीव जलिता जी रेस्पेक्टेड सुनील जैन जी रेस्पेक्टेड आदेश टिटामारी जी रेस्पेक्टेड रबार्टो एलबार्टी रेस्पेक्टेड फ्रांसिसो राफाज रेस्पेक्टेड नलिनी गुप्ता जी एंड लेडीज एंड जेंटलमैन माय मीडिया फ्रेंड्स टुडे इज अ ग्रेट डे फॉर बोथ द नेशन गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया एंड गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इटाली एंड थ्रू दिस जर्नी आई बिलीव वी आर गोइंग टू स्ट्रेंथ एंड आवर बायोलेटर रिलेशनशिप फ्रॉम डेट पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू आई बिलीव इट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट It is not that cruising through our coastal line, and but this kind of initiative always keep lot of positive vibration among the citizen of both the nation, and this friendship will create lot of new chapter of our future growth, mutual growth, bilateral growth. So this is the power of this particular event. This is significant of this particular event. Costa Cruz so that is why i wish all the luck to Costa Cruz and you have rightly mentioned that how this particular cruise has been successful in drawing attention of the global tourist in the last 75 of its service but now i want you to positively explore the huge potential of indian market by capitalizing coastal cruise ocean cruise as well as river cruise we can offer this particular facilities to you because we have the total length of 20500 km of river ways 7500 km of coastal so this is the available resources and you know india is one of the most beautiful nation in the world because of its civilization culture and heritage and beautiful forestry biodiversity and i believe to showcase indian culture and heritage this kind of cruises definitely can play a very very important role and that is why we have as you know we are now the most populous nation in the world our size of the population is 142 crores plus so that is the power of indian market now how to draw the attention of the people across the country to come to take part in this journey and i believe that is the strategy and planning need to be sucked out effectively with the most scientific manner and it proper publicity because information education and communication is the key to our any kind of initiative without this people cannot be motivated and connected whatever facility you have developed within the cruise that's need to be percolated to the ground let the people understand the most developed facility you have been there within the cruise so i believe this is one of the area definitely you will put your thought into it but you don't please confine only two months of your journey <laughs> please extend it let it be whole years as per the available you know climatic condition that is there in our indian atmosphere and already our chairman of mumbai port and also he is the chairman of ipa and also head now he is also heading the dg shipping so three important portfolio <laughs> so now he has already mentioned what are the policy and program we have put into the right perspective to facilitate our cruise liner so in the near future whatever best possible facility you require we are ready to extend our support and so far 
whatever infrastructure we have developed, I believe it is all standards, international standard level. And I am sure that once you start your journey again, then definitely you will discover India. Because for your information, I want to just mention how world longest river cruise was successfully sailed from Benares, UP to Dibrugar, Assam, northeast part of India by crossing 27 water river system and covering the distance of 3,200 kilometers through Bangladesh Protocol Road. That was a very, very successful voice. And within 15 days, and we have taken 32 Swiss citizens and landed in the different 50 different destination and taking them to the local cuisine, local culture, local like you know handicraft, small small industries, and seeing the beauty of India overall. So I believe this is how Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji has set his vision very clearly for the promotions of river cruise in India. And now we are very much happy to announce that many more citizens from Europe, they are willing to take part in this kind of river cruise in the near future. So this is the success story written in the river cruise. I believe you being the topmost, you know, ocean cruise liner. From that point of view, you have got enormous experiences and you have all kind of abilities and wisdom to take up any kind of challenges given in the different parts of the globe. I believe with that particular background, I want that Indian coastal line should be properly explored and with your better kind of initiative. And I'm sure that in the near future, if you put your effort, definitely we are always there to extend our support. Today, I do not want to give a prolonged speech here, but uh, I am really happy to take part in this particular very, very important occasion. And I was given a lot of briefing about your stature, about your uh, like kind of achievement by my officers in the last 15 days. They have been briefing, they have been glorifying your ability and performances. So I do not want to add any more. I am especially thankful to the Council General, uh, Mr. Uh, Masi, for your very positive species here. And I am sure that uh, government of India and government of Italy in the near future, definitely we are going to promote our relationship in a very, very like you know, kind of uh, positive manners by way of taking part in the different constructive project. And I believe our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi is, is always giving us that particular kind of support, guidance, and vision through which in the last nine years of his leadership, we have seen the lot of transformation in India. And you have also seen the transformation in all the sector of human activities have remarkably taken place. As a result, India has become the fifth largest economy in the world. So that is the power of Modi's personality and his leadership quality. Thank you. Jai Hind.